Open, open, open. Hi. <laughs> no! Ah, hi, you okay? The dream again. Which one? Loses key or key breaks key off? Key breaks off. Key breaks off. Yeah, yeah, I know. Mervin Super Sale now through Saturday. Doors open at 9. We promise. Mervin's big brand, small prices. Differentiated merchandise and an excellent in-store experience they've come to expect from Mervyn's. We take this so personally that we say Mervyn's starts with me. Mervyn's history goes back to 1949, when Mervyn Morris opened his first store in San Lorenzo, California, not far from the present Mervyn's headquarters in Hayward. Right from the start, that first store was a success. The suburbs were full of newly married couples with their first homes, and the baby boom was in full swing. Throughout the 50s, these growing families wanted good-looking, good-quality merchandise at prices they could afford, and Mervyn's met their need in a way no other store did. Mervyn's began to grow in 1962, and before long, new stores opened on a regular basis. In 1971, the company offered shares on the New York Stock Exchange, a move which set the stage for real growth. In the next five years, Mervyn's grew from seven stores to 35 and started opening stores outside the state of California. It was in 1978 that Mervyn's joined the former Dayton Hudson Corporation, today's Target Corporation. I kind of hate to see that uh, Mervyn's is leaving. Shoppers reacted to the news Friday that ailing department store chain Mervyn's will close. You just run in and grab little last minute things and it's, you know, too bad that now you don't have anywhere to run to. Maybe the outlet mall, but this was just in and out and, you know. The discount retailer, which operates primarily in California, will close all 149 stores. The chain has been operating for almost five decades and is just the latest merchant headed for extinction given the current economic slump. Um, I feel bad because I love Mervyn's. I really do. So, I mean, I wish they wouldn't close down. Mervyn's filed for Chapter 11 bankruptcy protection in July and now will begin liquidation sales of each store as it winds down its business. Mervyn's chief executive said in a statement Friday that all options were exhausted, requiring the company to take action. Mike Gracia, The Associated Press.